On today's Spicy Kist review, I have another hot sauce from the Arizona Spice Company. This is the Habango sauce. It's a mix of mango and habanero, so we got some sweet and we got some heat. Use as a marinade or dipping sauce, good on chicken, pork, fish, tacos, and more. Very simple on the ingredient list. White wine, vinegar, mango, water, habanero, garlic, a thickener like gorgum, salt and spices. So, as you can probably see here, I'm not sure if you can get a good look, but it's got some pulpiness and you can probably see some seeds in there. Just an FYI, I think I had about 27 cups of coffee today. Needed to pick me up. I love this color. Really, really nice color. Mm. I get the, the white wine right off the bat. It's got a sweetness. It's quite thick, which I really, really like. Look how thick that is. It's just pouring out like molasses. Again, just love this color. It almost reminds me of Lily Koi back in Hawaii. That's the type of color it is. But here we go. Habango hot sauce. There is a sweetness to the mango. It does have that pulpy feel, so you can probably see some mashed up mango in there, like a puree. There's a bit of garlic. I can definitely get that. This is quite good. Only five calories per teaspoon. It's very mild and holding back on the flavor at the front end and then it's kind of a mellow experience throughout. You definitely get that habanero heat. So I think overall it's a very good product. Personally I would like to be hit with a blast of flavor right up front but that's just me. Overall this is a very nice gourmet sauce. It's what it says it is. You know, you can put it as a marinade, you can put it as a dipping sauce. It's certainly not going to overpower anything, at least to me. I'm going to have another, another go at this here. But you can just take a look at how thick it, this sauce is. And that's one of my big, the big plus for me. Yeah, this is, this is great. There you can see the seeds. I, I don't know if you can see that up close, but there are seeds right on the neck of the bottle just inside there. Overall, I would give this a low four. It's pretty good. Again, if you had more flavor up front, uh, it probably would be a five then. But as it is, it's a really good sauce. I'll put a link in the description to Arizona Spice Company. You can check out some of their other sauces and um, you know powders, rubs, whatever that will be featured on their site. But this is definitely a nice product. Thank you for watching this review. Embrace that pain and I'll see you in the next video.